In this video, I'm going to show you how to add custom thumbnails to your custom videos that you've been putting on your Inatab 3. The first thing that we'll want to do is go download the Inatab customizer. There's a link, there'll be a link in the description that shows uh, where you can download this from. Once you have it downloaded, we want to attach your Inatab with the USB cable and we want to go into the LLN directory that's on your um, SD card. Actually, before we go in the LLN directory, I'm going to put the Inatab customizer onto my uh, SD card. That way, I always have this customizer with me and I don't have to try to find it on my computer again. So, first thing I'm going to do is, I got that on here now, I'm going to double click on it and it opens up. program looks like this. This program is written by a guy named uh, Nivs and this, this thing is really nice. Okay. So here it is, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and here's the one I added yesterday that's Despicable Me. And what I need to do is I need to find a picture that represents this, usually like a DVD cover or something. And so you'll need to go like on Amazon and download one. Here we are on the Despicable Me webpage. I'm going to click on this picture, and it pulls up this bigger one, and I right click on it and I say Save Image As, and you can give it a, a name, it doesn't matter what you give it. Big. and we'll save that down to the desktop. Back in the customizer I'm going to change, click on the add thumbnail, the change thumbnail right here and then I'm going to select my picture and then it puts it into the uh, little window there so you can see what it's going to look like. Now if you want you can go in and you can edit the picture and try to crop it just the way you want it to be or the easy way, like I did, just select a picture and let it crop it how it thinks, how it thinks it needs to. And we'll go ahead and we'll shut this off, and we'll boot the Inatab back up. So here we are back in the Inatab, and I'm going to start up the video program. And hopefully, when this loads, we'll see the thumbnails for all their custom videos and the thumbnail that we added on to uh, the movie. And look at that! There it is, the thumbnail. Oops, come on, focus. There we go. There's the thumbnail we added. And so that's how you can use it. The Inatab customizer program lets you add those thumbnails. Anyway, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments. And thanks for watching. And also, big thanks to Nivs for writing and maintaining the program. Anyway, thanks again for watching.